Okay, so in this example, it says the sum of two consecutive even integers is 694. What are the integers? So in order to do this problem, you're going to have to set up an equation. But before we do that, we want to come up with a couple of expressions to illustrate what's going on here. Okay, so let's come up with an expression that will show an even integer, right? So for example, if I do 2x, no matter what I plug into x, assuming it's an integer, okay, I'll always return an even integer here, okay? So for example, let's say I plug in a 1, I'm going to return a 2. I plug in a 2, I'm going to return a 4, right? I plug in a 3, I return a 6, and so on, okay? And now we also have to come up with a second expression, okay, so we can get the consecutive even integer. So for example, if I plug in a 1 here, I'm going to get a 2. How can I come up with a second expression so I can get that next consecutive even integer, which is going to be 4, right? Well, I'm going to take what I have and I'm going to build upon it. So I'm going to have 2x plus 2. So same thing. Assuming I'm plugging integers into x, okay, I'll get the next even consecutive integer here. All right, so you can test it out. If you plug a 1 in, you're going to get 2 here. If you plug a 1 in here, you're going to get 4. Okay, you plug a 2 in here, you'll get 4. Plug a 2 here, you'll get 6, right? So you can see how that will work out. All right, so what we want to do now is simply add these up and set it equal to 694. So I'm going to do 2x. Okay, plus 2x plus 2 equal to 694. Okay, at this point I'm just going to combine my like terms. So essentially we're solving for x. So we get 4x plus 2 equal to 694. We want to subtract 2 on both sides. So we get 4x equal to 692. So what we're going to do at this point is divide by 4 and see what x is. So we get 692 divided by 4. And we get 173. Now again, this is not your answer. But x is equal to 173. So what we do at this point is we go to the two expressions that we came up with and we simply plug this in. Okay? So 173 times 2. So when we do that out, we get 346. So there's our first integer, right? And if you plug 173 in to your second expression, you're going to get 348, okay? So here are the two even integers. They're consecutive, right? And they're going to add up to 694, okay? So this here is going to be your final answer. All right, and that is it.